Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Please don't forget to subscribe. We are here to subscribe to this channel. Please, please subscribe to the channel. All right, let's uh, move on and let's uh, talk about this uh, try on haul, this time boho. All right, so you guys, uh, things that I want to say. I just picked, you know, four items and I'm not gonna show you in this, uh, this try on haul all the four items because I decided to uh, focus and concentrate on two dresses and here we go with the first one so one premise that I want to make here is that the dresses are skater dresses which means they have the typical structure uh, for women that have curves and for women that have a little fupa or for women that they feel uh, you know, a wrap dress is the, the best option because it fits them uh, better than other other dresses and other dresses style styles. I want to say um, I picked two items that are skated dresses. All right, so the items that I picked are like semi some somehow elegant, but mostly uh, items they they are very versatile that you could wear with literally everything now don't mind me the don't mind the straps of my bra because i'm just here also my face was very much puffed but not the point here okay so we're discussing uh, we're discussing dresses okay so the first one that i picked was this one now you guys you see that i have this little uh tie um which is again tied in um, around my waist um, but you could tie that uh, tie that like on the side and I like this dress because of um, the cut um, on the uh, upper part of the body which is I uh, found very very flattering I found that dresses that I like that like that because I don't like necessarily like uh, sleeveless dresses um, are the most flattering when it comes in terms of when it comes when it comes down to fittings and when it comes down to you know just wearing something that you know um just kind of emphasizes this like the the shoulders uh without you know you know just covering them up too much or anything like that and also um in the back you see the steep cut it's quite elegant quite nice and then you have a zip which is guys um kind of hidden zip uh, there and so you could zip up and you have still like some cleavage it's not for really that much but it's like a little bit of an opening on the on the back now one thing that i want to say is very open and so i think this is extremely extremely comfortable um it doesn't tighten you uh it's not tight in any which part um so that's that's good um and it also um it covers exactly the right critical spots so um so for instance what i want to say here is that um it's a little bit um it's a little bit kind of hugging you know around the waist for a couple of centimeters but then um he has this kind of a line and then you have the ruffles or whatever voila um uh, which you know they start off on uh, one you know high leg um, so on a tie basically at the level of one tie and then they go down and then um, they cross cut on the other side um, and so I think that this fit is particularly flattering for women to have curves um, if you have like big butts or like you know some some butt um, that is flattering um, if you have especially love handles that's extremely flattering um, if you have if you have a hourglass shape that's particularly flattering so all of these i find it extremely comfortable extremely versatile because you could wear a pair of sneakers or a pair of heels and you just be all right and the color of it all i think it's amazing and it enlarges my um my butt which is which is nice honestly guys it's just nice it's so nice all right being serious um i would just say this is a yes dress. This is definitely a yes dress for me because I feel very comfortable. I feel I could go with this dress literally anywhere. Um, I could just, you know, adjust it to my needs and I'll be alright. And now we are with this second dress. Let's talk about the second dress, guys. Alright, so it's again another dress that cost me about 20 euros, something like that, alright? 
this one has a much much deeper cut and I think here somebody was wrong in cutting this this like this because um, I should like pin it and so you kind of will see or you know kind of see uh, my bra at points because on the one side this one should have been you know put it like put up and I didn't have anything that morning so um, you see that this thing is just dangling down which is horrible but not my point because I'm here trying to show you this dress alright so this dress what I discovered is that um, and you, you probably see this at the end of my video where you have what I discovered is that you need to you know kind of uh, put the this this lace this you know strap or whatever we want to call it not that up but you just have to go around your waist not to make you appear with the huge kind of fupa or you know tummy because I understand that the more you tighten um, especially if you have um, if you have hips like I do uh, the more you tighten this up the more it's gonna just enlarge. She has this, it creates this kind of balloon effect. But what I liked very much about this dress was the fact that it's a skater dress. Um, it's slightly longer on the back. Again, it's like a church dress. So like your butt, it just becomes way, way bigger than this, which is nice for somebody that doesn't really have a bump. Um, and you have this kind of, it's not even half, guys. I don't really know. So let's say that I like very much the color, alright? I like the material. I do not adore the material like I let's say I don't mind the material. And here you see again my bra. Um I like the fact that one is one on one side you just have a strap and the other side you have kind of a fake slip because you guys that's fake slip. However, if you don't have a huge breast here, um well my my breast is small, so but it's not that small. So Kind of small but not that small so uh, if you don't have a huge breast this dress uh, will create you some type of problem and I need it and I still need to adjust it and you guys I still need to paint my my walls so um, it's a long study I've been you know keeping the paint I've been keeping like the paint and I have this image in my in my mind on how I have to restructure my house but that's a different point um, so let me go back to this very dress and this very dress um, I like it. I don't mind it. I find it that it's fluttering. I find that it's versatile. I find that you could wear literally everywhere, like for a walk along the seaside. You could wear it uh, um, going out with your friends. You could wear it, you know, with your boyfriend if you have one, or with your girlfriend, or whoever. Uh, but uh, not my point. Um, I just would say that. So this is a bra dress. And I don't necessarily I'd like that much rough, rough dresses, but this one was a good one to pick because I really don't have any any rough dress, and I find that this one um, just just is is nice. It's nice. You could wear it everywhere. One thing that I would suggest, if you want to make this uh, dress more um, kind of a sport, uh, like more kind of sport oriented, let's call it that. Um, so more sporty, I would say. Just uh, wear like a white t-shirt underneath this dress, like a white plain t-shirt. It will look amazing, all right? Somebody, something like not with um, an eye neck, but like low neck, navy cut, no anything like that. And it will look amazing. And you could wear trainers and that's it. Voila, as the French says, um, say, um, I just found this is a useful trick uh, to know mm, and I think that it would just be um, amazing the overall look that you get uh, from this. And guys, for today, that's really it.